Hi, my name is Chris Woodall. I'm with Intermarine for Lauderdale, and I'm standing next to the 262 Fisherman made by Wellcraft. So I'm sitting on the 262 Wellcraft Fisherman, and uh, I'm sitting here facing aft, very comfortable, contoured backrest as you can see. And I'm sitting right next to the windlass. This is a vertical windlass. It makes it very easy to aim. You have an anchor pulpit, so you don't have to worry about scratching the gel coat on your bow. You have plenty of room in the road box here for your anchor chain to right. Right now, I'm very comfortable. I have plenty of things to hold on to. But what I can do is I can go forward. Look forward. And enjoy myself as well. Some of that is about is you actually have a worker cooler that's on slides. You can see the slides right here, and they come all the way aft here to give you a seat next to the helm. So opening this four entry head, you can see down inside. You have plenty of storage on port and starboard to store all of your fishing gear, paper towels, whatever you need to. That keeps it up and out of worm's way. What's awesome about this is you can actually get down here and functionally use it. You have plenty of headroom, plenty of headspace. It's awesome. So to the creature comforts of this boat, yeah contour backrest, which is very odd to see in a console that's 26 foot. These are contoured backrests, they make you feel like you're in the boat. You have handrails everywhere for safety aspects. You can walk all across this boat and always feel safe. So one thing that I want to point out about the Wildcraft 262 Fisherman is that you don't have the cheap plastic inserts right here where your gunnel storage for your rod stash is. This is actually fiberglass molded into the deck mold. So it's a more expensive way to build the boat. And it's also a more rigid way. You don't have to ever replace that plastic insert that comes along with it with a lot of the other manufacturers that are out there. So as far as fishability goes, which is one of my favorite parts of this boat, you have tackle boxes, both four. They're mirrored on each side, which is an option. These are insulated fish boxes, stainless steel gas assist struts to help hold up the lids. You can fit a five foot wahoo in there, dolphin, tuna, whatever you need. And it's mirrored on the other side. Standing at the helm, there's plenty of real estate for two 12-inch Garmin Simrad Raymarine screens, whatever you would like. We can install all of them. We also have the Mercury SmartCraft gauge that gives you all the engine data that is also streamlined into whatever chart plotter that you so choose. This boat's powered with the Mercury 200 naturally aspirated V6 engine. Perfect for getting out of the hole, perfect for fishing. The helm seats are very comfortable. You have drop down armrests on both sides and in holsters as well. So you can stand at the helm and actually determine which footstep is most comfortable. So now I'm standing in the back of the boat, which this is fishing central back here. I mean, this boat is plenty geared up to fish however you try to fish. So we've got a tuna door right here. Or a dive door if you prefer to spear fish. Optional ladder available on it, which makes it very easy to get in and out of the boat. You have three live wells in this vessel. You have one back here, it's about 25 gallons. You have 
optional. This is part of the leaning post aspect of it. You have another live well back here and it is a, a fish tank style. So you can monitor your bait, which makes it really nice. The most important thing on this boat, especially during our crisis right now, freshwater wash down. From sandbar and family aspect of it, this aft seat, which is almost beam to beam, is a great feature that this boat holds. So you can drop this seat down, and now you have seating for two or three, depending upon the size. Very easy to hold, very easy to deploy. One of my favorite features of this boat, and this is having boated for 30 years plus, is you have a beam to beam walkthrough right here, right? So you can board this boat from port or starboard. So you can walk across, there's technical non-skid along the deck. So for some mo more detailed photos, please visit our website, intermarineboats.com. My name's Chris Woodall, Intermarine Fort Lauderdale.